that things occur which you did not predict. And you should just say, no, you have to be careful to be in a situation where you see things you did not predict, but which are maybe more important than what you were looking for. In many cases, most people, they just throw it out. They say, okay, I didn't want that, so I'm not interested. But maybe that thing is more important than what you wanted to do. The other one is don't jump on a train. Don't try to jump on a train which is already full. There are some areas in science which are very, let's say, very fashionable, which are very interesting. Let's take one, MOFs. Huh? Mid middle organic frameworks, they're very interesting, okay? But so many people in the field. So the question is, if you have a very original idea, then fine, but otherwise try to find something else. Don't think along what you have been at, accustomed to, but sometimes you should ask questions which are, let's say, uh, contrary to what uh, you think uh, but you, 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 you are accustomed to. And even it's, a, it's, it's even an, a mind, it is, I think this counts for all of us. It's an exercise, a sort of a, um, um, ma, ma, a mind, an exercise of the mind to ask a question which is, goes against what is considered as right. Now, in most cases, this is stupid because you end up with something obvious. Like some, if some people want to go against the second law of thermodynamics, that is not a good thing to do. <laughs> then you waste your time. But there are other things where uh, there, is, uh, yeah, there, there are things to do which you discover. For instance, for us, something very important was 